How's it going students? In this video, I wanted to show you how to find valence electrons. So what are valence electrons? Valence electrons are the electrons on the outer shell or the outer orbital. Valence electrons determine how the elements interact with each other. And they follow the rule called the octet rule. All the elements on the periodic table want to have complete valence shells. They go around looking for other elements to complete their valence shell. So when you look at the periodic table, we first must identify the group number and all the elements in column one have one valence electron. So all the elements hydrogen, lithium, sodium, potassium, all these elements in group one have one valence electron. All right, so let me show you what I mean. When we build hydrogen, hydrogen is in what group? Group one. So let's build hydrogen, one, one proton, one electron. Notice, it has how many electrons in its outer shell? So it only has one. So that's why it's in group one. Let's continue on our path and let's build lithium. All right, so with lithium, notice how many valence electrons does lithium have? We only have one electron in its outer shell. That's why it's in group one. The elements in group two, so all these elements, beryllium, magnesium, calcium, all these elements have two valence electrons. And then the elements in this group, so group three all the way to group 12, these elements have various valence electrons and we don't, for our purposes, we don't need to remember uh, those. So we're, we are going to skip the elements in this block and we are going to go to group 13. So the elements in group 13 are going to have three valence electrons. And then what do you think group 14? How many valence electrons group 14 will have? They will have four valence electrons. So carbon, silicon, germanium, these all have four valence electrons. Group 15, it's going to be five. Group 16, six. Group 17, seven. And group 18 will be eight. There is one exception to this rule, and that is the element helium. Helium only has two valence electrons. The reason why it's in group 18 is because the first shell has only two valence electrons. So what that means is helium is complete with only two valence electrons. So it's already complete and it doesn't need to add any more electrons. It's the only element that is complete with two. Let's build helium. We have two protons, two neutrons. And of course, we have to balance it out. Otherwise, it would be an ion. So we have helium. Now notice the first shell, if I try to put another electron, it only goes to this shell. So what that means is helium is complete with only two. So this is what I was talking about earlier. Let's try another example. This will be our last example. Let's build beryllium. Take a look. How many valence electrons does beryllium have? Beryllium has two valence electrons because it is in group two. So that is how you find valence electrons on the periodic table. 